Hi, welcome back. In this video I want to quickly show you uh, what to do with the images once you've built your site. So, um, in this site that we've just built, if we have a look at the images, you'll see it's got the standard images there, intro 1, 2, 3, and the thumbs are all standard. So let me show you on the site how these uh, look. If we go down uh, to the next page, you'll see it's just the standard background. On the next one, another standard background. And on the portfolio, you'll see we've got the just standard default images. Okay, so how do we put our own in? Well, there's two ways uh, of doing it. Um, the first way uh, is by opening each of the images in an image editing software. So um, let's quickly do that so you can see what I mean. We'll open. Okay, so we can open this image, for example, intro, and then we can um, put an image on top of it. So, for example, um, let's try that one. We could literally copy this one and paste it in there. You could, as this is a smaller image, I wouldn't recommend this, by the way, to make a smaller image bigger because you'll lose resolution. But there we could, and then we could save it, uh, which I'll do now just to, so you can see. And then that image will appear on our site when we upload it. So you see it's been changed. Okay, so you could do that with uh, each of the 15 images. Or you, if you upgrade it or you get the image niche sets where you've got images already made for specific niches, they're already formatted for the right size and so forth, resolution. So let me come through. Here we can see some of the image sets. And if we take the golf one, for example. Um, now all you would need to do is um, Control A to select all, Control C to copy, then come back to your website and make sure you're in the images folder, and then Control V to paste them all in. It will ask you if you want to overwrite, and you'll say yes. Overwrite, copy, and replace them all. And then you'll see you've got the golf images in. In this case, actually, what I want to do is put the business pictures in. So let's do that. So Control A, Control C and then come into the images folder of your website control V to paste and copy and replace them all okay once that's done you upload them to your website and we'll do that now this time we just want to update the images we open the images folder on the web server where we put the site select all the images and literally just copy them across. It will ask us if we want to overwrite, and you say yes. Okay, they're all uploaded now. So if we go back to the website and refresh it, we can see all of the pictures have now been changed. We open the light box, you see the images there as well. Okay, I hope that's explained. Uh, thanks for watching, and we'll cover FTPing in the next video.